हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल होप यू आर डूइंग वेल सो जुपिटर इज़ गोइंग टू टर्न रेट्रो ग्रेड फ्राम फोर्थ ऑफ सेप्टेम्बर टू थर्टी फर्स्ट ऑफ डिसम्बर ऑलमोस्ट फोर मंथ्स वेन एवर अ प्लान इट इज रेट्रो ग्रेड इट एक्स इन अ डिफरेंट मैनर इन संस्कृत इट इज़ कॉल इज वक्री मीनिंग ट्विस्टेड सो रेट्रो ग्रेड मोशन इज एक्चुअली अ थिंकिंग स्टेट वेर यू आर सपोज टू रिफ्लेक्ट एंड इंट्रस्पेक्ट अबाउट द एक्शन और डिसीजन यू आर टेकिंग और हैव टेकन इट इट इज़ लाइक लाइफ इज गिविंग यू सेकेंड चांस टू थिंक अबाउट इट It doesn't mean it will only be bad for you. It can turn either ways for different people. Like Saturn retrograde is actually good for Aries lagna, while Saturn direct may ah uh, create some problems. So it depends on an individual level. Like always, if you're running Jupiter dasha, especially Maha dasha, this transit shall be more impactful for you. Okay. Now let's talk about each ascendant. Ah, uh, Jupiter will turn retrograde in your first house where Rahu is already placed. This may not be a very good transit for you. You need to be very careful in your decision and actions. Your focus will be on your health, appearance, personality, and there will be an urgency about it as well. You will be extremely concerned about others, like people out there, the world. How do they see you? How uh, what do they uh, uh, how do they perceive you? What do they think about you? Kind of like you are looking for some kind of validation from others. Jupiter is your ninth and twelfth lord. Your belief in yourself and how you think about yourself is something that will matter. So keep a positive mindset. You are powerful. There can be struggles with respect to your well-being. Maybe family responsibilities or children or work is keeping you too busy to look after your own self. Don't do that. There is no such thing that you have to act now or you will miss out. So stay calm. Take care of yourself and then. Rahu can also make you overconfident, so watch over it. Read the documents twice before signing up any important contract. Don't rush; you're not missing out on anything. There can be struggles and relationships as well. I don't see a relief on a uh, stress front, so make sure that you take things slowly, carefully, and focus on the moment. Okay. Jupiter will turn retrograde in your twelfth house conjunct Rahu. There will be a feeling of hopelessness within, like there is something that you desire uh, badly and you are putting in the efforts and, uh, but but it is not working out. You feel stuck and uh, you don't know what uh, you don't know now what to do. Whom do I seek help? There is a feeling to run away, to escape, uh, to go away from the struggles, to get some peace. Uh, mind is hyperactive. okay at least till uh, rahu change signs okay uh, maybe past disappointments or trauma is haunting you and making you impulsive to make something happen in the aspects of health finances and um, and life in general there is a desperate urge to improve your life and make it better and you are completely in that war zone like no matter what i am not giving up i am fighting with all my strength and i will achieve it even if it is slow so this is a good thing you are moving one step at a time taking um baby steps and making small changes uh, rahu conjunct retrograde jupiter in aries is making you feel that you are stuck things are stagnated and that you can't stay in the situation forever uh, patiently waiting for someone to get you out of the, uh, the situation okay you will have to take charge to get things moving and you are successfully doing that you are not failing in your efforts but it is a slow invisible progress while you want it suddenly which is not happening okay don't stress yourself or um become frustrated by the results the journey is leading you there sleep today for productive tomorrow no point in stressing day and night for things not even uh, not in your control your health should be your priority a huge relief will come your way once rahu ketu change signs okay jupiter will retrograde in your 11th house this is good in terms of gains and desires you will strive to work hard towards your desires and building wealth you will achieve it too but your greed will also increase here there can be struggles in relationships you don't know whom to trust and uh, you feel people are mean and opportunistic maybe a recent breakup or a tiff in a relationship is the reason you're not very eager to socialize or even engage in close relationships because you feel people are interfering in your life too much 
or uh, they are speaking or asking something to you that triggers you or hurts you uh, be careful of your desires it is multiplying so catch hold of yourself before it de starts dividing your life invest in learning or creativity like taking short term courses which will prove highly beneficial there can be some unexpected gains and even speculative business can uh, can give good returns don't get influenced by your network circle or get personal with it cultivate the art of ignoring and believing some people just don't exist the wisdom you gained in your past relationships is going to come in handy in the present relationships or friendships and people you bond with in the future love will come to you but you will need to wait for some time until rahu ketu changing signs then things may be better on a relationship front okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your 10th house why are you so adamant to change something in your career you are doing great in your work you have got the capabilities why there is insecurity you are clearly losing hope in your work like you feel that this this uh, won't be good uh, in the long term or maybe i'm not growing at a quick speed or um, you know this 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 is not serving me something is triggering you to switch jobs or career altogether there is this rebel who wants to take the road less traveled but contrary to your belief it is important to stay put with your work you are doing good in it have faith in yourself and in your work your efforts don't get carried away by uh, short term results there can be societal uh, pressure or maybe you are being overly concerned about your reputation or something that is making you feel that i'm done with this work now i want to do something uh, a different something adventure is something big where the growth is huge or there is this high raise uh, promotion and a good work culture or good environment free of office politics you know etc so this is not true rao is giving you the feeling that other people are doing great compared to you which is not the case okay uh, grass is greener always on the other side okay so stop comparing your journey with others stop listening to people around you find small ways in which you can feel secure in yourself you are being insecure because of the people around you and you feel there is lot of competition lot of challenges i am not doing well no trust yourself spend more time at home with your loved ones nurture self love try maintaining your calm and ignore the noise it is just an illusion definitely fame will increase at your workplace watch your communication with your colleagues and also try maintaining a safe distance with people at work especially till rahu ketu change signs okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your 9th house most definitely traveling bug will bite you you will want to visit exotic places where you normally don't go there will be a great boost in your courage and suddenly you may feel powerful enough to do anything but remember there is a thin line between confidence and overconfidence be cautious in taking decisions your connections with close people friends family siblings uh, neighborhood uh, you know neighbors shall certainly improve take some time out to pursue your hobbies improve your communication skills marketing skills um uh, how you connect with people it will help you don't be adventurous for the time being uh, don't take risk uh, too much risk okay you will want to break free from the current situation or place and take a bold step so hold on to that decision for now do things that make you happy you may also develop interest in different cultures and you may invest time in reading ancient scriptures and ninth house is the house of higher education so make a careful choice here i'll suggest if it is possible to take it after uh, you know rahu ketu change signs decide after rahu ketu change signs about the course you want to do or the stream you want to choose there can be some struggles with father mentors teachers elders in the family especially till rahu ketu change signs okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your 8th house Uh, when things are not going according to our plan there is no point in being frustrated and impulsive it is not in your control don't fix it if it ain't broken here you want to change something desperately but it is just not happening 
some chronic health issues can resurface but may not get cured because of not getting diagnosed so i'll suggest to wait till november for the test and treatment don't get overwhelmed by the life challenges everyone on this planet has to go through ups and downs in life consider it as a phase that after a certain time you know it will it shall change or may stop bothering you there can be struggle in relationships with in-laws or some responsibilities focus on the people who support you and are your family there can be sudden unexpected gains in terms of investments or inheritance be careful of your secrets be careful of people you connect with during this time things will not happen all of a sudden life doesn't change overnight so you will have to uh, let go of those expectations and there will certainly be reward awaiting for you if you are patient enough and let the universe do its work okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your 7th house the focus is on relationships spouse marriage and other people you need to be very careful in your relationships during this time especially till rahu change signs you can be um there there can be a question of honesty loyalty uh desires not getting met and a feeling of not having the right partner so dissatisfaction of some kind can uh prevail this is about either side even you can be cheating someone or even you can uh you know get attracted to someone else this also shows deceiving others if you are not in a relationship or getting deceived by others you will feel a sense to act and uh, decide the fate of your relationships like maybe i need to end this relationship break up or file for a div- uh, divorce or maybe not feeling happy and satisfied so acting on it see you will be tempted to look outside and other people will be more attractive to you so please don't take any such impulsive step hold on till november you will also shine among others people will compliment you on many aspects and you will be flattered by a lot of things but understand they don't value you but the success and fame you have okay the money you have the all the you know um the things you have the things you possess not you okay so they are not your true well wishers don't trust others easily don't be influenced by others easily you don't need their validation it uh, rules your 6th and 3rd house so there will be some relief in your challenges okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your 6th house this is actually a good transit for you you will overcome your problems and competitions but you may also look out for quick fixes don't do that you need to shut down the voice of the world and listen to your inner voice that will give you the solution you are looking for get isolated or spend time in quiet uh, which uh, which may help you okay also learn to let go of the people places and even situations that hurt you or uh, that um, doesn't serve you if you can't forgive people forget them forget their existence detach from them okay don't get stuck in situations that hinder your growth and peace also don't be too quick to leave that job to do something of your own wait for some time don't take on any debt and if you have taken it don't increase it there can be struggles in familial relationships romantic relationships or even with children it is important to hold on to your finances and not invest it in an expectation to make more money also romantic relationships need to be handled with care and if it is toxic and abusive then also leaving it and letting go is also important here health can be a concern so take care of your health and food habits maintain a proper routine where you can balance everything i don't see any problem in finances though but it is important to spend time in isolation meditate and listen to your gut instinct don't take any decisions or actions in haste listen to your intuition for it okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your 5th house are you planning to earn some extra money and you think speculative investment is the key to it i don't recommend that at least in rahu change signs not a good time for conceiving as well be sincere in your studies or any course you want to take else you will have to regret later If you are a student don't choose any course or subject because of peer pressure or family or someone else tells you so okay 
you can invest time in mantra chanting and learning during this time there can be some issues with health or maybe you don't like how you look um your appearance your personality so you can make changes in your appearance time after november when rahu shall leave jupiter you will uh, you may feel some relief okay there can also be something to do with family or at home front that can impact your peace of mind you may also get clarity and relief in your romantic relationships or relationships with children as rahu changes signs there can however be feeling of not being happy in your life happy with your life so uh, don't lose hope and don't be doubtful of whether you will achieve success or maybe uh, uh, you know you're also uh, doubting uh, your skill set or uh, you know whether you're creative enough or your potential basically Uh, see this is a test of your faith and you should not lose that it is important to believe in yourself don't be disheartened or don't be attached to someone enjoy new friendships and explore new avenues okay jupiter will turn retrograde in your fourth house don't be impulsive in buying any assets or home read the documents at least twice before you sign up you will want to change the place of your residence or run away from it uh maybe there are some conflicts at home or with mother or some memories or emotional trauma something uh something is impacting your peace of mind and you want to run away from it you want to break free from it there can also be changes at your home renovation uh or the way you organize or decorate things or the or the way of your living uh lifestyle there can also be a sense of fre- uh some pressure felt from mother like maybe you should get married or uh, maybe something else okay uh, you will however sense some relief when rahu changes signs uh, you may feel a lack of love or happiness or a feeling of content or satisfaction missing in your life it is important to distract yourself for the time being so focus on your career your work and strive for growth promotion or raise try pursuing activities that make you happy and at peace you're not feeling secure within doesn't matter how good you uh, you may be doing in your life something is bothering you take care of your health jupiter rules your third and 12th house efforts may not yield desirable results and that's a lesson where you need to let go of any fears and disappointments failure is not permanent you will also need to overcome your fear of going out in the public like maybe you are an introvert who doesn't like meeting people but you can only get better at it if you work on it okay so you will have to face your fears and this will also boost your confidence okay Jupiter will turn retrograde in your third house. You will get a huge boost in your confidence and courage. So great time for taking initiatives, but there is also a warning here. Don't take a leap of faith in everything and anything. Don't be impulsive, don't be overconfident. Yes, explore different things, be brave, have faith, but also know the destination where you are headed. Know about the consequences of your decisions and actions. If possible, take help of mentor, uh, mentors, teachers, or elders. Don't take decisions in an impulse. Learn about it and then act on it. There will also be a sense of doubt in your decisions, like you may take some steps watching others do well, but you yourself may not be confident in it. So definitely, you are kind of working about uh, upon your confidence. your self worth and uh, your decision making skills your communication skills rahu is conjunct jupiter making you insecure doubtful and yet showing fake confidence uh, you're trying to prove at this that you you are in, in your power okay don't do that if you want to grow you will have to overcome your fears okay overcome your insecurities watch out your communication with others people around you can also be manipulative so be cautious while trusting others it's not a good time for higher studies or traveling long distance there can be struggles with finances so keep a tab on your expenses trust yourself don't feel inferior just because you don't have something sometimes people who are not highly educated like having you know uh, degrees or uh, uh, any, uh, you know phd's they are knowledgeable okay then people who have more degrees what matters is uh, you, you are able to do the work in your field you are okay so you are able to do justice to your work you're good at your work your skill sets are important okay and see journeys are not the same circumstances are not the same so how can you compare okay but everyone has the opportunity to make efforts okay so and you have that willingness in you okay so trust yourself believe in your skills okay and uh, 
strengthen that okay and you can also go on a pilgrimage during this time okay Pisces, Jupiter will turn retrograde in your second house. There can be struggles with the family. So either you may want to go away uh, from family or you may develop a rebellious approach when dealing with them. You may feel a lack of support from the people whom you value. There's a sense of not getting what you are giving. So now you are adamant about catering your needs and not caring about the responsibilities of the family. It doesn't mean you don't love your family. But you are striving hard to earn money so you can help your family. But now there is some feeling of restriction. Okay, there, there will be some relief and route change signs. However, the focus will be on building wealth to fulfill your needs and wants. Okay, you need to be careful of your indulgence like alcohol or drugs or uh, smoking or even food habits. You will also focus on how you... Uh, how you look especially the this facial aspect okay taking care of your skin and you know changing that eyeglasses the lenses uh, that you wear etc okay it's important to accept changes in your life okay transformation is important for growth so don't be afraid to make changes in yourself or uh, your work or your public image or your approach to life okay endings are necessary for new beginnings okay you will want to have things which you didn't receive from your family and now you want to do anything to fulfill those desires. But yes, you will want to go away and it can be anything simply uh, too many responsibilities. Okay, so you want to, uh, you are so overwhelmed by it. Okay, or it can be anything. Okay, there will be this feeling of, uh, you know, uh, escaping from this uh, family. Okay, escaping from the tradition, something like that okay so yeah that's all for today i hope you resonated with it until we meet next time take care